So what's the best and the worst thing about being on tour with everyone? There's more, definitely more good than bad. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I think the worst thing is that you're away from home and you're not in your own bed, really. You're like kind of away from your family. But, I mean, you have your family away from home, yeah. which is uh, our best friends. You have to perform with your best friend every night. <laughs> and what's the, the most sort of challenging aspect? I mean, did you, was it more challenging for you because you're obviously performing in a wheelchair than, than the touring? Um, I, I, th yes. I actually think the biggest challenge was it was a whole different process than shooting the show. And so it was definitely taking care of ourselves because we're traveling so much in such a short amount of time. So as boring and lame as that sounds, I, it was definitely like, okay, like we finish the show, we're going to fly to another city, do a show there, then fly to another. So it definitely was a whole different process of getting adjusted yeah. to that. So let's talk about the message of the film. Ha tell about the message. Explain to me what the message is about and how can you relate to the message? Um, I mean, essentially, the, the film is about and for the fans. Um, I think the message is that this is their show and this is affecting, this is bigger than all of us. Um, the concert tour was only made possible by these these amazing kids and um, who are so devoted to us, but uh, I think it's, it's, you know, it's what the show is. It's about the underdog and it's about watching us, you know, go out there and perform and we're like, what is happening yeah. right now? I mean, I think we feel like them, which is cool. It kind of puts the characters and the fans in the same playing field for the first time and people can see that and it's not just kids it's adults who really relate to the show and it's as fun for us to watch as I think it is for fans to watch because it's it's very touching. Yeah. Now um, what's going to happen in season season three? Artie's been a bit mean to girls lately. Yes, <laughs> yes he has. Is he going to grow up relationship wise? I hope so. I it's know, about time. I mean I get it. I understand. I was happy to do that and show that sometimes irrational, <laughs> as irrational as you may be, it's not the proper way to talk to women, but um, I hope so. Yeah. It would be nice to have a relationship that lasts a little longer than a few months. Well, he's getting the goals, so... Yeah, I know he is. He's doing something right, he but is. he just doesn't know how to finish it. He doesn't know how to, like, keep on, like, yeah. it's just... He hasn't learned that yet. So what's going to happen with, with your romance in the, in the show? Yeah. I don't... Listen, I don't know. I have the longest standing relationship on Glee right now with, with Mike Chang. Sure. You were a close contender, but we were really close. But, um, I mean, I know that Tina and Mike are, are doing well and they're going to stay together for a while, but I wouldn't be surprised if already, you know, shot in there somewhere. Just rolled in. Try and, to get her back. You know, try to win her back. We'll see. Rolled in. Yeah, just rolled in. Unintended. <laughs> 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 so, um, who would you like to? I know you get asked this question a lot, but who would be your ideal uh, guest star, movie wise, ideal guest star cameo on, on the show? Um, you just had a good one, Hugh Jackman. Yeah, I always say Hugh Jackman. I think he's great. There's also Christopher Walken. I Christ think he yeah, Christopher great Walken too. is kind of becoming the collective. Yeah. We all want Christopher Walken on this I show. I mean, he's ridiculous. That'd be crazy. He can, he's on Broadway, he can sing. Yeah, he can sing, he can dance. He can dance. Mm -hmm. And what's your favorite, what was your favorite number to perform in the movie? I mean, I'm a little biased, but I think Safety Dance was, <laughs> yeah. was my favorite. That was actually really fun because I did it too, so that was a good one. It was fun to see you dance. <laughs> yeah, I was excited. I didn't think I would get to do it, but I have the girls to thank for that. And lastly, will we see Artie? We, we saw him walk once before, mm -hmm. briefly, with the aid of the machine. Will yeah. he... In the next season, will we see him walk again? I don't know. I mean, I think... Or in a dream sequence, maybe? Or? I mean, Ryan and Brad and Ian have always dealt with that really nicely, and I think they've done it um, with class. Mm -hmm. And so, um, whatever they feel is right, I'm happy to do. Yeah. Thank you very yeah. much. Of course. Thank you. Nice meeting you.